no plans, no plans at all Evil man's always transcending Fight her like sheep, swallow everything Always simple tins or pretending We got no plans This is your moment of clarity from LeeCamp.net There's a new ExxonMobil commercial that's been playing a lot It talks about how wonderful it will be to have the tar sands pipeline Through the middle of the entire US Because building it will create jobs It creates jobs, it'll create jobs right here in America Says the smiling man from ExxonMobil Who doesn't have any ulterior motives at all Large corporations also talk about all the jobs it will create if Congress would just allow them to bring their offshore tax-dodging money back into the United States without it being taxed. And I agree. Americans need jobs. But is helping tax dodgers or building environmentally devastating oil pipelines the only way to create jobs? No. No, it's not. There are others. And I'm proposing we get started on the following projects to create jobs right now. Number one. We clear-cut Alaska's grizzly bears. They're ferocious, they're angry because we're wiping out their habitat. I say cut them all off at the ankles and that will create tons of jobs. You'll need trackers, bear experts, ninjas with samurai swords. Jobs, jobs, jobs. And don't worry, if we leave the ankles, they'll grow back. Number two, we build absolutely redundant oil pipelines across the entire United States. Millions of miles of leaky pipelines. Think about it, you gotta build them, then you gotta, gotta, gotta poke holes in them, then you gotta clean up the mess. That's a lot of jobs. So picture the oil spill in the Gulf of Mexico. Before the oil spill, you had like 30 guys working on an oil platform. After the spill, thousands of jobs cleaning up that shit. Number three. We murder everybody named Luke or Lance. Luke's and Lance's are generally assholes, right? So you murder them, and then you gotta clean it up, and then you gotta hire a counselor to counsel Luke's douchey friends on their grief. Lots of jobs. Number four, blow up the Hoover Dam, rebuild it out of Cheerios so that it collapses every week or so, and you gotta start over. Number five, we redirect the wind sweeping across the Great Plains to wind farms in the north and the south of the country. Sure, you could build the wind farms where the wind already is, but that wouldn't create nearly as many jobs as redirecting the jet stream. I don't know how yet, maybe giant kites or something. Number six, let's tie all babies together. Not in one area, I mean across the U.S. Wherever there's a baby, it's got a tether connecting it to all other babies. Lots of benefits to this. Every time a baby moves, he has to pull on all the other babies, so that would slow him down. There'd be no more kidnapping or baby escapes. And it would create, create an insane number of jobs to connect all the babies and then monitor the baby connecting network. And finally, number seven we cause cancer in people. As much cancer as possible. And we'll try to make it the treatable kinds. Treating cancer takes tons of work and money and jobs. You say oil pipeline creates jobs, I say cancer pipelines. Let's bring cancer to every American. Everything on this list would create jobs. So I'm starting a partnership with ExxonMobil to make this list happen. Together, we can make America strong again. That's your Moment of Clarity from LeeCamp.net. Also check out the Moment of Clarity podcast where I get deeper into the issues I've talked about here on the videos. I also talk with guests like Janine Garofalo, the Yes Men, Chris Hedges, John Oliver from The Daily Show, and others. It's free on iTunes, the Android app, Stitcher.com, or LeeCamp.net. Thanks. Plans, no plans at all. Evil man's always transcending. Fight her like sheep, swallow everything. Always simple tins or pretend.